need to read this book for a while because I've heard of it being banned and challenged and you know the first time I saw it when I was in like high school I didn't care too much for it but now I'm just like okay I have to know what's up. Today I received Oppression by Jessica Therion from the the debut authors challenge blog and so that that whole tour thing and there was a little nice little note on the front and I will read it. Hi Elizabeth I hope this book gets into your hands safe and sound. I feel I've I really enjoyed it, and I hope you do too. Can't wait to hear your thoughts. Alexa at Alexa Loves Books, and that's her name on .com and Twitter. And so thank you, Alexa, for sending a little note along with it. I, I like that. I like when people send you little notes along. Then I have books from the Breathless Tour. I went last night, and so you'll see footage of that sometime in the near future within the next week or so. I got Legend by Marie Lou. I'm about 30 or 40 pages into this and it's really good. It's nothing like Hunger Games or Harry Potter like I had heard it being compared to, but I really enjoy it. I think that it's an awesome story and it's lovely and it's told from two different perspectives, which I love. That's just a good a good trend to go on. I like that. Which brings me to my next book, A Million Sons by Beth Revis. I've been listening to the audiobook, but I wanted to get the actual book signed. And so I bought this and it's beautiful. And I'm uh, we were talking about this last night that we're glad that they kept like a, a similar theme with the cover. They didn't change everything to look like the um that back there the the paperback that's what the paperback looks like for the first book but i'm glad that they stuck with this and i was like the spine yes i am in harry potter we're stroking the spine of the book so it will behave well ah. i'm supposed to be comedic i don't i don't know if it's gonna come off that way and then we come to the pretty pretty cover of born wicked by jessica spotswood this is a beautiful freaking book and i haven't read it yet but i see the cover and it has that like hillary duff elixir whatever that book was called that feel to it it's almost like leathery and so I, I like that also I have some cousins with the last name Cahill and so I was like that looks cool and I saw this in the Penguin their catalog they have like catalogs that they put out for books that they're going to release within the next you know few months or year or whatever and this was one of them and it's it, it's on the cover of one of them and it's pretty I like it so much those three books are signed just so you know in case you are wondering I love book signings. They're so much fun. You get to meet like book bloggers and stuff and hang out with your friends as well as seeing awesome authors. And so if you ever get a chance to go to a book signing, do it. And then in the mail from Sasha from Sasha and M, she sent me Black Heart. I should probably take this off. She sent me Liz XO Joy Joy XOXO Sasha Ha. I am so just yes, I can't wait to read this. I have I have to read uh, Oppression before this before Ha, ha. You know what I mean when you have a hard time because you're just like, I need to read this one and this one and this one. But I, I cannot wait. I just recently, within the past couple of months, uh, read Red Glove. Probably more like three months ago. But I'm excited to read Blackheart. And then Sasha and M sent me a package today and it's a mystery package. Apparently, I know they tweeted me about it, but they, they were like, hey, we're gonna send you something. And so I have this package that I'm going to open on camera. These are the, the, the trusted scissors, the handy dandy scissors as uh, Blue's Clues would call it, yes. Okay. sent me The Selection by Kira Cass. Is that how you spell I, I know so many people named Kira or Ki some form of, they spell it, pronounce it different ways, but oh my gosh. I saw this on all the debut author tour stuff and wanted to read it and so I'm glad and thank you guys. You are beautiful, wonderful people and I owe you all of the books. Like seriously, they are so nice and so wonderful and basically yes. And they sent me, oh, they have like a little, little cards now and stuff. I swear, I don't always get that many books or anything like that. I just have a lot of people in my life that bless me with things like books and awesome things like that and friendship and magic, you know, friendship is magic. 